Well, welcome back. Welcome to another session of Fools Rush In. Uh, my name is Matt, and I'm here with Greg and Nick. Uh, we are your Christchurch Fools. Uh, we have had some good feedback come back from uh, the questions from CC Respond. I know there was one that was a little off topic that Greg wanted to make sure we hit before we started our conversation. But once we do that, we are going to get into talking about how Jesus actually dealt with some of these racial issues, if, if he did have racial issues. But I'm going to turn it over to Greg to talk about that issue real fast. Um, you want me to talk about the finance one first? Yes. Um, okay, so let me do that. And then I, I'm just, I'll put a bow on this one and then we'll go to the next one in a, in a subsequent kind of thing, if that's all right. Sure. So um, let me just bring it up. Here was the question that was asked. I'm going to share my screen here. The question was, would like to see updates of our financial status, especially during these difficult times. So this one um, actually was just a really, I mean, our financial year has been amazing because of the generosity of Christ Church uh, members. And so this is total revenue. The orange is just general, the blue is general fund giving. The orange is additional give, so total giving. So that would be general fund plus um, like a cap, the capital initiative money. And then the, the uh, gray is total revenue because we do have some other revenue that comes in through Hertz and the JDS who pay us a lease on that. So if you look back since 2016, our total revenue this year is up higher than any other year. Our total giving is up higher than any other year. And our general fund giving is almost as high as it was in 2018. And it would have been higher except that some of our benevolence money has actually been put into this orange category with the food for thought. And so if we were putting all of that into general fund, it would have been higher, but it doesn't matter how we account for it. The bottom line is that the money that's come in has, has been more than any other year. If you think about that in a pandemic kind of season, it just points to uh, the goodness of God and his grace. This is through the first six months of the year, the percent of the annual budget through the second quarter. And back in 16, it was 36%, then it was 45, 46, 46. This year, we're right at 50%, 50 which is also significant because we receive a, well, by far the, the biggest month of our year is in December at the end of the year. And that's true for every church. And so the fact that we're already at 50% of our annual budget is all through June. And again, this is through June. That's, that's substantial. Uh, this is revenue to expenses and then the net. And so you can see our revenue is up. Our expenses are up, but not, for instance, what they were in, in a couple, at least in 2017. And because of that, our net is higher than it's been. But here's what's great about that. If we look at the spending in 2020 versus the spending of 2019, we had the, this blue is what we call ministry. That's what we spend inside our building to help do the work of ministry at Christ Church. And the orange is what we call outreach, which includes all of our benevolence. This is what we spend in our church. This is what we spend in our community. And so that was 2019. When the pandemic hit, we decided to cut back as much as we could on ministry expenses, but expand what we're doing in community. And so you could see that our community expenses, particularly because of benevolence during this time, has gone up substantially, and our ministry has gone down rather substantially, which, which is what allows this expense number to be higher than it was in prior year. But all of that increase is because we've chosen to use our funds to help those who are in need. So it's just, you know, it's just a great, it, it, it goes back to what we keep saying, and that is that this is all of God's money 
and he always provides everything that we need. And that's true as a church, and it's true for those of us who are in Christ. He's always, um, he's always faithful in that. Yeah, and I, somebody may be watching this thinking, well, why are we talking about the finances right before we get into some of the social um, things? Obviously, one, uh, we want to be honest with you when we say, if you send in a question, we're going to look at it. And it was another way that we wanted to show um, that God continues to bless Christ's church because of the work that is being done to help and serve others. And so it really does tie into to this justice idea of being able to, uh, as a church, put our money where our mouth is in terms of serving others. And so um, I know that uh, our family really appreciates what Christ's church as a whole is doing to be the hands and feet of Jesus.